Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hi everyone. Today I'm going to talk about this course project that will be conducted in the end of our course, General English. I've already explained about our project in the very beginning in our first meeting. Do you still remember? As mentioned in our syllabus, the goal of this course is to enable you as students to understand and able to use four skills of English. Therefore, this project includes the four basics of English skills such as listening, speaking, reading, and writing with the emphasis on speaking. In order to equip you with the four basic skills of English, the teaching and learning process during the whole semester has been focused on the practices of this skill. So, what is the purpose of our project? Can you try to guess? Yes, correct. The purpose of this project is to find out your achievement in speaking skills. There are two components of the scoring. First is the PowerPoint creation, and the other one is the presentation. And the question is that, what should you pay attention to these uh, things? So let me start for the um, rubric for your PowerPoint um, score. So first thing first, the content uh, should be accurate and all required information is presented in a logical order. And then the second, the presentation flows well and logically. And presentation reflects extensive uh, use of tools in a creative way. And number three, uh, the PowerPoint slides transitions are smooth because transitions enhance the presentation. And uh, don't forget that your image should be appropriate. Layout is pleasing to the eye. And this is very important. No spelling errors, no grammar errors, and the text is in your own word. So remember about this. Next, what about the rubrics for presentation? First, uh, you have to maintain good eye contact with the audience and is appropriately animated. For example, gestures, moving around, and others. And also, you are supposed to use a clear, audible voice so that the audience can understand what you say. And then, uh, your delivery is poised, controlled, and smooth. And also, uh, you are supposed to have good language skills and pronunciations are pronounced correctly. And also, visual aids are well prepared, informative, effective, and not distracting. And finally, the information should be well communicated. All right, so how will you start your project? Here are the following steps. First thing first, choose the article provided in my class, and then read and understand the article carefully, and then share your understanding about the topic in a PowerPoint presentation, and prepare your presentation, deliver your presentations in front of the classroom, and study the trick and tips on presenting the article. All right, so that's the beginning of our project. I hope you understand about my explanation. And if you want to know further about our project, you can access the information in my class. Thank you for your attention. And wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.